Thank you, uh, Deputy. And I come in on that. Um, and I, I visited Cork Airport as well and met with um, the officials down there. And uh, I, uh, exactly as you have said, um, look, it's not just Cork Airport, it's right throughout Ireland, our, our regional and our state airports are, are in severe, uh, fina under severe financial pressure. And I know Cork is not under the regional airports programme, uh, nor is Shannon, um, but given their commercial status, there certainly is a case to be made for further measures. And I think we have both said it here today, the importance of maintaining um, that connectivity uh, right across the island. Um, and also in relation to the aviation task force, as I stated earlier, there are some of those um, measures have been implemented. Many are benefiting um, employees within the aviation sector to the from the temporary wage employment scheme to the pandemic unemployment payment. Um, and again, that was an initial um, support package at the start of the of the pandemic. But now we're in a new phase. We've recognised that. And as part of the budgetary um, deliberations, that aviation task force, those recommendations will be considered in that context. So because we can't talk about the budget, and I certainly can't talk about the budget here today, um, but you can be assured that we're very concerned about the aviation sector within Ireland, across all our airports, those jobs, those families, this is directly affecting, not only within Cork, but in the wider region. It has such a spin-off effect, um, likewise in Shannon for the Midwest region. So we're acutely aware of this, and part of that, there's a few things happening at the moment, the whole trying to get a, a testing regime that will be robust, that, that is workable, um, and as Minister Ryan says, it will take time to roll that out, but it's important that we give that certainty to the aviation industry in relation to the, our direction of travel and, and our commitment to ensuring that this industry is supported and that when, hopefully, we have a, a, you know, a, a vaccine and things can get back to normal and there is confidence there again to fly, that this industry is ready to reboot and grow. Look, I thank you, Minister, for your reply and that.